Hello guys, I'm Sam from Rimal Tech and today I'm gonna put the brand new stabilizer Stabies to a test. With the stabilizer Stabies, surprisingly you get it in a plastic case. Behind you have the branding with the manufacturing date. Inside you have divisions for the housings, the wire, the stems, washers, screws and you even have a 7 new spacebar included with the kit. These are promised to have more tighter tolerances and need no lubing. But let's see if they fulfill the promises in our test. Next participant is the C3 stabilizer kit. I have the tangerine edition and these look pretty good. I have lost the original packaging. They should be much better than the one currently I have. These also include the 7 u spacebar wire and uh, these are considered one of the best stabilizer in the market. And the last up we have the most popular stabilizers, the Duroc V2. I have the smoky edition. Unfortunately, you only get either the 6.25 or the 7U included in this kit. You get all the regular accessories like the screws, the washers, housings and the stems. For the sound test, we have the IK68 R1, P4 modded and tape modded, polycarbonate plate, Alpaca looped and film with EPBT bow PBT keycaps. For the stabilizer, we have looped the housing with Kytox 205 Grade 0 and the wire with HexHT BDZ.
So in my opinion, the stabies pretty much exceeded my expectations of the stock stabies actually sounded good and for many people out there it does remove the hassle of wing your stabilizer there was still some amount of rattle so you still need some amount of loop to make it perfect as for which i would choose among these three it would be the c3 stabs because i personally loop uh, the stabilizers because i always uh, look towards perfection and uh, the c3 actually sounded and felt good while typing also you know what sounds and feels good smacking that like button and the subscribe button to get notified whenever i upload awesome keep content like this one and that's it for today guys stay safe keep typing peace